All right, family, welcome back to I Love Me, Me, Me. So the question of the day is, should you delete your ex's pictures once you get into a new relationship with a new man or a new woman? Stay tuned. All right, family, so to answer the question, the quick answer is absolutely yes, you should. You should be deleting pictures from your exes and getting rid of all of that information, the text messages, the pictures, the emails, everything from your ex if you are now in a new relationship. However, I personally, now this is my own personal, I still do have some, but here's the thing. For me personally, this is why I'm kind of on the fence. You know, I, I said yes in the beginning, but I will say it also depends too. And here's why I'm saying that. Because my pictures, now this is my own personal situation. My pictures um, are many years back. They're in the cloud and all of this other stuff. I don't go seeking out the pictures to delete them. I do not go seeking out the email to delete them. But what I do is, if I come across them and I am in a happy relationship, they do get deleted. For some reason, like say, say for instance, I'm looking for something, I delete them. Also for me personally, I don't take a lot of pictures. I actually forget a lot. So with me and a guy taking pictures and everything, I don't have a lot anyway. And so for me, I might even forget that they are there. But if you are a person that is posting every single solitary time, you get all of these pictures of your ex, absolutely you should be getting rid of those ex's pictures if you have a new boo, especially if you're happy with the newest boo. Excuse me. Thank you, baby. Thank you. So yeah, I think that you should get rid of them. But again, if you're like me, <laughs> you hardly ever take pictures. You hardly ever post. I do post of me and my boo, but it's very rare. She's calling me. She wants to be a part of the video, as usual. <laughs> yeah, so, so I try to stay away from them. You should go ahead and start deleting the threads and the emails and all of the pictures and anything that you can think of because really you want to keep your heart open for the new person that's going to come around. You don't want to be holding on and still have emotional attachments to someone else. But if you've forgotten that those things were there, then you've forgotten. Again, I forget that they're there until I come across them, and then I will delete them. Or like if I have a physical picture and it's not on my phone, then I'll get rid of the picture. But I'm not seeking to go out of my way to say, let me get rid of this picture because now I'm in this new relationship. But you should start to eliminate some of that stuff, especially if you have things like pictures up in the house and all of this stuff. Like, I personally don't do all of that stuff. I actually forget. Like, I'm just now putting family pictures up of me and my boo like, like and the baby. Like, we were just now getting the family pictures out in my own house. I, only, I very rarely post on social media. So that's not something that I personally have to clean up or wait to clean up. You know, but you, if you are a notorious picture taker, you're a notorious poster, you're a notorious, notorious, um, where you got all of this um, email messages back and forth and text messages back and forth, absolutely start to get rid of some of that stuff because when you're holding on to that stuff, you're actually holding on to the relationship for whatever reason. You might have the hopes of it getting back online if this new person don't work out. But try not to do that. Keep putting all your eggs in that one basket because you will be more focused on them. You'll be more focused on getting that relationship on track. The last one didn't work out for a reason. All right, let me know your opinions. You know that I love to read you guys' comments. Of course, leave them down below. I have already released my online courses. Check them out. The information is down in the description box below. And of course, I am compiling a playlist for the month of March. So all of the questions that you missed that I've already answered, you can go ahead and check out that playlist. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Two finger salute.